Mood Mate. Now this is a little app to help you be more reasonable or to manage your moods a bit better. Now this is a long line in a series of apps that I've been looking at just recently that tend to do this. But is this one any good? And why would you choose this one, being that it is a paid service, over any of the other ones? Or even any of the free ones that would give you the same sort of thing. So let's take a look now at Moonmate. Hey guys, Rob Murphy from Holistic Healing Choices here. Now, as said in the intro there, we're looking at Mood Mate. So this is a little bit of an app that looks to help you basically stay in control of your mood. We now get into it. I'm going to take you straight into what would be the morning exercise. So for this one, I'm going straight off what it's got here. So here we open up into Mood Mate. Now, it is like a text chat with an AI. Pause for a little bit of reflection. Let's do this. What makes you a happy person? I'll think about it. So I'm thinking about all the things that make me happy. It's important to often remind ourselves what makes us happy. Till later for now. So that's just one of the brief little demos of what Moodmate does. Now, as we go uh, back up through our chat, these are, right here, the sort of things that most commonly come into it. So, you win a trip to a country of your dreams. Unfortunately, the trip is for only for one and you can't take anyone with you. What would you do? I'd go and enjoy myself. Okay, so normally on a day, you would get something like this. Recipe for a good mood. Genius lies in simplicity. We go over life situations and with me, you have the time you need to think things through. And your brain will know how to behave in such situations. Let's work out. So with pleasure. Now, our first little thing here, we've got into an argument with a loved one. And they're camped on the side. So they've camped on their side, despite your best efforts. So they're all the way in their way of thinking. What's the most reasonable way to act then? I pout and make them feel guilty and apologize. Well, that bridge is burnt. I look up persuasion techniques. Well, I accept that we have a difference of opinion. So the main thing with these ones are they are pretty easy in which one you should go with. So obviously number four, exactly. Even the closest people have their different points of view. Then you go to the next situation, which is winning a trip to the country of your dreams. Probably not real relevant right now. Uh, what would you do? Because it's only for one person. I'd go and enjoy myself. It's a dream of mine. I'd have to turn it down. I can't fully relax without my better half. It's not time to relax yet. I've got work to do. I'll unwind later. I'll try to find a way to bring someone along. But if I really can't, I'll go on my own. So obviously, once again, number four. A bit of time on your own can be really nice, actually. It'll help refresh things through, discover new ideas and things. Have fun, enjoy your own company. It works like a charm. Now, the next situation. This one just went straight to got a minute to talk. I do. Have you ever been betrayed by someone? Or berated by others, rather? Things like you'll never amount to anything. You're useless. Yep. Hmm. These kind of things can really take root deep within us and ruin our lives. Let's try to vanquish that. Okay. So remember a note down three of these kinds of phrases that you've heard about you, or at least one. Take them in carefully, so that's our indication to write it down, jot it down, or think about it. Now take these notes and destroy them. Tear them apart, burn them up, put your heart into it. Bit of an evil laugh. And now think and note down new phrases to yourself. Phrases full of love, care, and support to yourself. Always happy to help. See you tomorrow. And that is basically what it does. It's text, it gives you a few little multiple choice thingos, like here's another one. It seems that you've, that if you ease down and start giving your loved ones less time and attention, that something bad is going to happen. What seems to be the most reasonable approach to this? Well, I can't say everything in the universe depends on me. It can be tough, but taking care of my loved ones is my duty in life. My loved ones can take care of themselves, and if they need help, they can always simply ask. If I don't take care of them, I'm just going to feel guilty. Obviously here, number three. So it's not always number four, like those two other examples. It's <laughs> very basic sort of stuff. You get a couple of exercises, maybe a day, if you do it. And you can always say, not right now. I haven't actually done that yet. And that's basically it. You choose the thing, or you do the little exercise, and you take the little suggestion on board. Now, other things, you can make it a dark theme. You can go to your arrangements and contacts, or agreements and contracts, sorry. Your time and frequency of how, <coughs> when it works. Ah, here we are. So there's a contact information, the schedule, which is not playing the game at the moment. In the morning at 9.30, in the afternoon at 2.30, in the evening at 8.30. 
based on your time zone, should be five o'clock to you, which it is pretty well. Now you can change that there. Yep, that's true. So when would I like the morning ones? And so forth and so on. Now topics and subscription. So my subscription is active, available. Topics under my next subscription is a thousand. So I haven't actually purchased any topics. So now if I want to change my subscription, I can just cancel it or not now, or I can go to show all topics. So here we've got all the topics that you'll be able to have with Moodmate. And they're quite varied and cover all aspects of life, which is very good as well. But really, it's up to you how you, useful you find this type of app. And then there's got the command field, which I don't know what you could type in there. So obviously it's still in early stages of development. Quite happy I found it and being able to go through and do some of these things on it. It's been a a nice little experience in your morning and in your afternoon it's just nice to have that little bit of motivation or insight into things as well but would you believe that this is sitting around 62 dollars a year for this preloaded sort of content for me that is not worth this the app itself i love it it works fine does take a little while for it to load sometimes and that's on either the mobile network or on wi-fi so i don't know why it takes so long to load some of these things as you're going through those messages but hey it does and really it comes down to it in are you going to get that much use out of this app i find it you know it's not offensive it's not anything it's easy to use and whatever else but really when it comes down to it I haven't been able to justify that price. $62 is a lot for something that you, know, you can really get for free just by watching a few YouTube videos or reading a book on some of these subjects. It's not offering world-breaking, life-changing tips. It is teaching you how to be reasonable, but that is giving you a multiple choice thing on how to act in a certain situation. and. I haven't come across any of the situations which are really life-threatening or putting you under a whole lot of pressure. And two, is it enough that, oh, okay, now I know how to act reasonable in this situation, am I going to be able to apply that in real life? Because I've just done, you know, a quick two little, two minute little exercise on it. So there's a lot of things that I like about it and there are a lot of things like, is this actually useful? Will I actually learn that much from it? And so with that, at the current moment, I can only give Moodmate a 5 out of 10. I really want to like it, but it's just not enough and just not applicable enough. If it was able to show me a way that I can integrate some of these skills into my life and be able to think more stoically or more reasonably in everyday situations, as well as more high pressure situations, hell, it would elevate that score a whole lot higher. But as it currently stands, it just isn't useful enough. But anyway, guys, that's just a quick little one on Moodmate. What are your thoughts on the app? Have you used it? Would you use it? Would you give it the seven day free trial that it offers just to test it out and see what you can do with it? But anyway, guys, that's it from me. Remember to share, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.